Milwaukee, like all growing cities, generates a lot of food waste. On average, about 47,000 tons is sent to the landfill every year. When food waste goes to landfills, it rots and produces a powerful greenhouse gas called methane. It also fills the landfill faster, requiring new ones. But what if we turn the food waste into something valuable instead, like compost? Capturing where the food waste is, where it's going, and how we can incorporate it to reuse this material versus just letting it go to a landfill. Rather than sending that food residue to the landfill where we can't recapture it, it just makes sense to compost it and, and get it back out to farmers and those of us who know how to use it and recycle it um, to grow food for the, the next crop. Not only can we grow healthy food and compost, but it can also enrich our communities by creating lush green environments and acting as a sponge to absorb stormwater and prevent the discharge of untreated sewage into Lake Michigan. If we can better utilize turf to hold water, we can do a better job of managing that water where it falls. Thanks to a sustainable agriculture grant from the U.S. Department of Agriculture, Milwaukee area businesses, universities, public agencies, and concerned citizens are coming together to change the way we handle our waste. Together, we're supporting the city's goal of diverting 40% of waste sent to landfills by the year 2020. We also hope to make high quality compost more available and affordable in 10 Milwaukee zip codes. To get there, we need to change how we think about our waste. It can't be talked about as waste. You've got to change the perception of the value of that material. You've got to start looking at where its value is to the end user. So how do we get there? With the cooperation of many local businesses, the City of Milwaukee, the Milwaukee Metropolitan Sewer District, local universities, households and gardeners in the city, and sustainable farmers throughout the region. The grant from the USDA is supporting university greenhouse trials, outdoor trials, and field days at Cream City Farms on Milwaukee's north side, free composting workshops, policy analysis, engineering design, data collection and mapping, supply chain analysis, and participation from over 50 university students at three different universities. Now that people start to understand that composting is coming into play, now it's revitalizing our soils. Now people are understanding that organic food comes with organic soil. So it's an educational piece that also comes with this. It's absolutely necessary. We're not gonna be able to move forward until we actually solve this problem. This whole discussion, this whole grant, is about using compost in a way that will help make Milwaukee a greener place. More partners are welcome. For more information and updates, check out and like our Facebook page. And you can also contact us 